What is good, Greg Gang? Me and Ethan's out here today. This video is gonna be a little bit different because I'll be honest, at this point in time, I don't even know what we're gonna be doing. But here's what I do know. I know that me and Ethan's going to help my dad with some work. We're doing some like, still really don't know but he did say there's some ponds and it's somewhere in the woods so we're taking a fishing pole you never know by golly we may run into a pond or something I'm thinking snag a fish or a turtle inside the face or something then we're also going to take ethan's new gun which is his 22 magnum you may feel like you've seen this gun before because i have one just like it in 17 hmr and i love it so he got one in 22 magnum right here is what 22 magnum looks like so it's literally just a longer 22 which will make it faster let's actually run up and just ping it at a target let's do it you got to sight it in at 100 yards right yeah. That's something you can't do with a 22. And it can actually hold itself at 100 yards. It's hitting the target size of my pinky at 100 yards. Now, just be honest with you guys. There's not a lot of things in season that we could actually shoot. But there is one thing on my mind. And it's been on my mind for a long time now. And it's a stinking groundhog. I don't see very many groundhogs. Hopefully, we'll come up on one. But I don't know, guys. We'll figure it out later. I've Maybe. I've always wanted to eat one. They're good. Are they? I don't know. Now, I've heard a lot of old people say they're good. Kanye! If that ain't majestic, I don't know what is, dude. One day this week, we need to get Kanye's a couple girlfriends. Because right now, his only friend is literally just Steve. The ghosts just, like, move him, and he's ter terrified of Daryl. Let's say, I say let's stack up right here and just ping that one. Which one? Either one. You think you can hit it from here? Yeah. I don't reckon you hit it. No. Alright guys, if we if we see a groundhog, we're just gonna hope he's closer than that. We're cutting into the video for a minute to tell you about today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Now if you don't know, Raid is a super expansive game with a ton of content where you battle these things called champions. A champion is basically the characters that you fight with, and each one of them has their own very specific skill set. And the best part about it, you can get it all on your phone and play pretty much anywhere. If you want to get Raid yourself, you can use my link down in the description to download it from, like I said, your phone or even your PC. Now a couple of my favorite champions in the game has to be Astralon, number one because he looks cool and he has two gigantic flaming swords, but also his third skill actually takes all the buffs from your opponent. And Turbo, this man hits hard, all of his skills are about dealing damage, which makes him a perfect player pretty much anywhere in the game. Now, out of all the things that Raid offers, my favorite thing about Raid itself is how they have PvP, campaign, Raid bosses, dungeon runs, and now they even have a Doom Tower. Basically what I'm getting at here is that Raid has a ton of content and they always add more. So what's new for this month? They released 11 new champions, almost 200 new missions, which will unlock a new legendary champion. And as if that's not enough, they added five new hard levels to almost every dungeon. So click the link in the description, download Raid for yourself, and get started. Now let's get back to the video. <laughs> Alright, but uh, so like I was saying a minute ago, I don't exactly know what we're doing, but there is a chance of death. I don't think we want to die on an empty stomach, so where we eat that? It's breakfast, by the way. It's like 10 o'clock. I don't know what sounds good to you. I would say Wendy's, but honestly, the food dissolves in your mouth. There's just nothing there. Your eggs like water. Sponge. Yeah, I would say Mexican, but I don't think it works like that. No, we'd have a bad day for both of us. Yeah, that'd be really bad. Let's see, we're going through the middle of nowhere. You know where liable to find if it's in the middle of nowhere? Just a random store that fixes like bomb bacon eggs. Dude, cheese. that's a really good point. Do you want to hold out on that and hope? McDonald's ain't got nothing on the <laughs> ratchet hardwood pumping sh stump. I don't know. All right, guys, we'll give you a little update on the uh, gas station. Um, we found one, and we went in, and all they had was one frozen pizza, two tubs of ice cream, and blue jeans. Yeah, we just uh, we decided we didn't want to eat a frozen pizza this morning, so we're just uh, not going to eat. So well, I don't we do, I don't know what to do. I'm kind of hungry, but we're just going to figure it out. I don't know. Anyways, up here is where we're going to be working. What are we going to be doing? Honestly, I still don't exactly know. I think we're throwing green stuff on a dirt. Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. What is the green stuff? Um, I think that, I think it's seeds. Yeah, that's pretty much what we're doing. And we're getting on an army truck today. I have no idea where it is though.
just to summarize what's happening, what we are doing is putting seeds on a hill to, you know, let it grow. Basically what this land was before my dad came in and fixed it all, it was just an old coal mine thing and it was just a bunch of dirt, rocks, and it wasn't growing anything. So he came in, fixed it, and right now we're in the process of putting seeds down. Now all the stuff that you just saw was um, uh, kind of a lot to think about, so I'll break it down for you. You can look way up there and you can see my uncle. Oh yeah, that one guy that was up there that's actually shooting the cannon, that's my uncle. The one guy that I said was my dad, that's my dad. I don't know, he was the one down at the water pump, but they're up there spraying. I'm down here in the truck for a minute, getting these last minute edits done. But yeah, right here in a minute, once they get done with that little load, we're actually gonna head out to another really weird store and uh, this one actually has bologna sandwiches. It's also about to fall in the river, but that's a whole different story. How was it, old son? Old oh, son, it ain't bad, you know? No, it ain't bad, it's fun. I wouldn't call it fun, but I wouldn't say it's bad. The thing about it is you know you've had to watch for your life. You can come right off top of that. We ain't even got to the bad part yet. But we're gonna eat first. We're actually gonna eat this time. Neither one of us has actually ate anything today, which is why I can't even talk straight. Anyways. All right, boys, we just got out of there. This is what our food came in. A stinking gigantic bag. I'll be honest, guys, it was like $16. I just got a ham sandwich. That's what I got, but I feared for my life the whole time. I figured one little hop and we'd be swimming next thing you know. Yeah, there may or may not have been gaping holes in the floor. And right there is the river. That is indeed the river. It's a really cool place. It's in the middle of nowhere. One guy, he was not revive needed. Unfortunately, didn't have any med kits. Then if you also look closely, you'll notice the 12 gauge stacked up in the corner. Let's head on up there and let's go ahead and start eating this. I think it should taste pretty good. It better taste good. For that price. Honestly. It ain't worth fifteen dollars. Guys, we're using some uh, non-traditional tactics. The army truck will not go up there, so uh, we're gonna make it go up there. This is the part that could end very badly, but you know what? We're just we're just gonna we're just gonna hope that it doesn't. You know, this ain't even the steep part. We still gotta go up that part. <laughs> this is definitely steeper than 45 degrees. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Uh. And there they go. The front wheels are completely off the ground, so that's nice. All right, now I'm gonna get out of the way because I'm about to get sprayed. <laughs> The truck is now in free roam. What will happen? Will it slide down the hill and flip? We don't know. We're about to find out. Something may happen. A tragedy may occur. These jokes may not age well. We're about to find out. They could steer left and then just like completely destroy the truck and me. Then you'll never see this video. There she comes. Oh, they're going up front ways now. They're really pushing this five ton to its limits, huh? I'd say it probably has a little bit better chance going up than it does backwards. That's going to be an interesting spray. Will he get it done or will it possibly tumble down backwards? So far, no casualties have been taken. Only a couple expected for the rest of the day. Oh, I think Ethan just ate it. Ethan, Ethan totally just ate it. They are fearing for their lives. They might not make it out of this. WHSN reporting live with channel 000 news. Will the two Kentucky men make it out of an 85 degree incline? Hang around till 10 o'clock to find out. And we're back with Chet. Your favorite reporter. Looks like we just got news from Ethan. He says, dude, I almost fell four times. Pfft. Yeah. You think we didn't see that? Nothing gets past channel triple zero news. And your favorite reporter. Jet
reporting live with an eyewitness. What did you expect when you came out here today? I thought I thought we cut trees. You thought you was coming to cut trees? Yeah. Wow. Okay, well, that was a disaster, but here is a random box that we just got in the mail. Um, uh, we're gonna open it and see what's in it, because at, at the moment, I don't know, I don't actually know or remember at all what it is. Oh, bet, baby. Let's go. That's exactly what he's wanting, the KG ghillie suits. Anyways, here we go. We got KG. These are not on the market yet. I do want to say that this is just like a, not necessarily a prototype, but like a first issue. Y'all are definitely getting an inside look if y'all's checking that out, but it comes with a bag so you can carry it. And then for the ghillie suit itself, here it is. Here's the top part so that, you know, instead of having to completely switch to like camo pants, I just take the KG camo ghillie suit. Check this out. Slip it over just like that. And boom. I'm camoed and gillied up. Can you even see my legs? No. What's cool, what I just noticed, what? the mesh has yeah. camo behind the mesh. Yeah, the camo's the mesh. That's a little light, but it's not bad because leaves are that color all the time when they get faded out. What do you think about them? I like them. I do too. And then this right here, this is the body part. This is going to be key for like summer squirrel season because it's really hot. No one wants to put on a big thick camo coat just to stay camo. That's why you can wear this even in short sleeves. But like I said, like they're not for sale. So. Kanye! Stop! 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 Oh my gosh. Like literally, I'm literally like not even here anymore. Okay, Ethan, this is the moment to redeem yourself. This morning, I'll be honest, wasn't looking too hot. Anyways, if you look way down there at the gun range, you can see a few white things on top of the beams. They're about the size of a pop can. They're actually small silhouette targets that are metal. So if you miss a prone, that's just on me. Yeah, it's just, that's just you, dude. I like how it's a rim fire, so like, it's not gonna be super heavy. Fire when ready. You missed. What do you see? A white ball. Wanna change angles? All right, so basically what we just figured out is whenever you can actually see, I just want to say this guys, um, turn on your post notifications because we have a really special week coming up, but I ain't going to tell you what it is. If you hit this one, they have to subscribe. If you miss this one, we're just going to disco disown him from the channel. He hit it. Subscribe. You are now contractionally obligated to subscribe.